Blessings, Lafayette family and Facebook friends. My daily message for Friday, May 27th. And I remind you that daily messages, lots of great stuff, are at fountainchurchtallahassee.org. And join us every Sunday at 1030 for worship. My scripture is Ephesians chapter 5, verse 2. And walk in love as Christ loved us and gave himself up for us a fragrant offering, and sacrifice to God. This is the word of the Lord. Did you know that archaeologists are reclaiming ancient odors? Yes, that's right. You see, you don't really want to know what it smelled like in, say, ancient Egypt. You know, when the swampy Nile created all kinds of fetid odors, and when people didn't bathe and there was no air conditioning, and if you think of Cleopatra or Nefertiti, you probably wouldn't have been able to get within five feet of them Ah, except for perfumes. And did you know that archaeologists are reclaiming odors by studying the residues of the biological makeup of these various aromas, whether they are naturally occurring or whether they are from perfumes. And in fact, they're close to recreating Nefertiti's perfume right down to the last after scent. Well, I think this is kind of fascinating to discover what it is that ancient peoples smelled. I'm not sure I want to know exactly how they smelled in biblical times. I'd rather read and learn and enjoy and revere the word of God without that crossing my mind. But remember that the Bible teaches us that the aroma of God is sweet. Have you forgotten what the beautiful scent of the Lord's love is like? Do you need an archaeologist to unlock it for you because it's been so long since you considered it? Oh, the taste of the Lord is like honey drippings from the honeycomb. And the aromas of the Lord's love are beyond any earthly perfume. What that means is God's love in Christ is something to celebrate with all our senses. Let us pray. Lord, we thank you that we can reclaim some ancient aromas, but we do pray, Lord, that you would never let us get too far past the sweet taste of the Lord's word and the beautiful aroma of the Lord's love. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ.